So the way that this meerschaum was carved, and considering how thick the, uh, the walls are, it's coloring most everywhere except for right here. I'm not quite sure why, because this part is connected to the inside wall, and this part is not, yet it is coloring. I mean, you see that little space? They left a little gap, an artistic uh, decision here to gap that. But just below that lip, it's, it's once again connected. That's not coloring. But the part that is not connected is coloring. It's about the same color as the rest of the, uh, the pipe, so I'm not quite sure not quite sure why it's doing that. And it's doing it the same all the way around. Well, here you can really tell on this side. You can see how white <laughs> the mirror shone used to be and where it is now. Actually, I think one of the biggest reasons why it's not coloring as, as dark as some meerschaums I've seen is because I don't handle this meerschaum with gloves. As you can see, you know, I'm a working man. I've got dirty hands, but I don't have time to wear fancy ass gloves and I want to enjoy this pipe. So I paid a pretty penny for this damn thing. and I'm going to smoke it regardless. I don't give a shit if it takes off some of that wax. Cause I know that's, that's what's really coloring is the wax, not the meerschaum itself. But anyway, you know, considering how dirty my hands get sometimes, I'm, I'm impressed that the pipe hasn't gotten dirtier than it is. And, and maybe, <laughs> maybe what you're saying is, is not a colored wax, but rather just the grime for my hands. Either way, I've colored my meerschaum. I just wanted to rant about uh, something. Certain people that fall in higher socioeconomic strata, why is it that they feel like if, if they interact with a person wearing a uniform of any kind, usually somebody in the service industry, why is it that they feel like they can be acknowledged, but they shouldn't acknowledge the service people? Just a simple, like, simple common courtesy, like uh, phrases like, thank you, or you're welcome, or maybe have a nice day. Even a nod, even eye contact. Some days, you just deal with so many of them, it just seeps in. It just seeps in a little bit, just enough to get, just annoy you to the point where you make a rant video about it. Oh, today is a gorgeous day. Just a few clouds in the sky. Temperatures around uh, 85 degrees Fahrenheit. Low 80s uh, in the shade because there's a breeze. Anyway, yeah, I just wanted to express my thoughts on on this whole this whole problem of not being treated as a, as a regular human being with some common courtesy and just simple acknowledgement of of services rendered. For example, if I open the door for you, you know, and then you walk through without touching it once. Would a thank you completely obliterate the little soul that you have in your body? Would a would a, a an eye contact with a, a head nod just kill you? I mean, is that so difficult for people to do? And this was the same in Oklahoma, and this was the same in, in Georgia. It doesn't matter where you are. If you, if, my general consensus is, if if you come from money, then. It's like you, you just can't acknowledge common courtesy. It's like, well, sure, yeah, nice things have to be done to me because I shit gold nuggets, you know? That's just how it is. So why should I thank anyone? You know, that's that, that kind of snobbery, that kind of... Just, a, just even acknowledgement that we exist and what we just did for you, uh, whether it's opening the door, deliver your package, serve your food, but especially on nice days. Like, why, what reason do you have to be such a fucking snob, you know? to those of us who are, who are doing your service. I can't tell you how many times I, I I go out of my way to do something nice for someone, and if I get maybe eye contact, I'll consider that a good interaction, but for the most part, 90% of the time, nothing is said, no eye contact, they just go on as if I'd never existed. And that kind of interaction, that kind of interaction is so it's such a bitter uh, thing. It leaves to those of us in the service industry with such a bitter attitude towards those who are affluent. 
anyway, I just wanted to share my frustrations on on that subject. Uh, anyway, I hope uh, all of you are having a, a good start to your week. And uh, I'm going to enjoy the rest of this pipe once again, get my last pickup for the day, and uh, I think I have a beer waiting for me at home. So until next time, may all of you have pipe thoughts galore.